Hey guys, this is Madman Mars 2000 with your TNA Lockdown 2009 pay per view results. First up, the pre show match Eric Young defeated Danny Bonaducci via pinfall. Finish saw Eric Young pin Bonaducci with a small package after the match. Eric Young and Danny Bonaducci shook hands, however, as Eric Young turned around to leave, Bonaducci attacked him from behind with nunchucks. Danny then used the nunchucks to choke out Eric Young until Rhino came out to make the save. He gored Bonaducci. In a pre-recorded segment, Team 3D cut a promo on the streets of Philadelphia, walking the famous Rocky Balboa steps. Brother Ray talked about the Philly crowd. He said they will leave tonight with the tag team titles. Brother Devon said they will prove they are the greatest tag team. Up next, TNA X Division Championship Escape Match Suicide vs. Jay Lethal vs. Consequences Creed vs. Sheik Abdul Bashir vs. Kiyoshi. First man eliminated was Kiyoshi by Jay Lethal. Lethal scored the pinfall elimination on Kiyoshi after hitting the flying elbow drop on him. Second man eliminated was Consequences Creed by Sheik Abdul Bashir. Bashir scored the pinfall elimination on Creed after hitting a DDT on him. Third man eliminated was Jay Lethal by Sheik Abdul Bashir. Bashir actually stole this pinfall elimination from Suicide. Suicide hit the hit Jay Lethal with the Suicide Solution. Bashir then grabbed Suicide and threw him into the cage, and then pinned Lethal, who was still off from the Suicide Solution. It's now down to Suicide and Bashir. Suicide defeated Bashir by escaping the cage to retain the X title. Finish saw Bashir and Suicide both on top of the cage, fighting to escape. Suicide knocked Bashir down with a headbutt. Kiyoshi then ran back out and started to climb the cage before Tini security grabbed him and pulled him down. Suicide then stood on top of the cage and jumped off, crashing down on Kiyoshi and Tina security on the floor to win the match and retain the X title. Backstage, Lauren asked AJ Styles and Christopher Daniels that they are on the same page. Styles said he and Daniels are on the same page. Lauren welcomed Daniels back to TNA and Daniels said that he has now been reborn again. Queen of the Cage match, ODB, who had Cody Deaner in her corner, defeated Madison Rain, Daphne, and Sojourner Bolt via pinfall. Finish saw ODB take a swig from her flask and spit the contents into Sojo Bolt's face. She then power slammed Bolt to pick up the pinfall victory. After the match, ODB and Cody Deaner celebrated the victory in the ring. Up next, IWGP Junior Tag Team Championship match. The Motor City Machine Guns defeated No Limit in the LAX via pinfall to retain the IWGP Junior Tag Team Championships. The finish saw the Machine Guns hit their tag team finisher made in Detroit on NATO to score the pinfall victory and retain the tag team titles. And if you haven't seen uh, Made in Detroit, it's a really cool finisher. I can't really describe it. It's a Tower of Doom style finisher in the corner that takes place in the corner turnbuckle. It's really neat if you haven't seen it yet. I can't describe it to you, unfortunately, though. In the back, Lauren interviewed Abyss. Lauren said he is con concerned about Abyss. Abyss said tonight it's about survival. He said tonight he'll take out all his frustrations on Matt Morgan. And I think I might have accidentally called Lauren a he at the beginning. I meant to say she, obviously. A Doomsday Chamber of Blood match, Matt Morgan defeated Abyss via pinfall. The finish saw Matt Morgan hit a spine buster on Abyss on a pile of thumbtacks and make the cover after Dr. Stevie, a.k.a. Stephen Richards, ran down and distracted Abyss. Backstage, JB interviewed Jeff Jarrett. JB asked what side Jarrett is on. Jarrett said, we'll see tonight. Jarrett said he needs to worry more about himself. He said tonight he'll do the right thing. Joe confronts Jarrett as the segment ends. TNA Knockouts Championship 3-way match. Angelina Love, who had Velvet Sky in her corner, defeated Taylor Wilde and Awesome Kong via pinfall to become the new TNA Knockouts Champion. At one point in the match, the beautiful people tied Awesome Kong to the cage with their own hair braids. Finish saw Taylor Wilde attempt to go after Kong, who was still tied to the cage by her own hair. Kong kicked Taylor Wilde away, and Taylor fell to the mat. Love then pinned her and scored the three count to become the new Knockouts champion. Lauren interviewed Team 3D in the arena with a bunch of fans around. Devon described it as a homecoming for them. Brother Ray welcomed Beer Money to a Philadelphia street fight. Ray said, this is the biggest tag team match in wrestling history. And Team 3D drank beer with the fans. 
Philadelphia Street Fight for the TNA World Tag Team and IWGP World Tag Team Championships. Team 3D defeated Beer Money via pinfall to become the new TNA Tag Team Champions and retain their IWGP Tag Team Championships. The finish saw Team 3D hit the 3D death drop on Robert Roode through a table after James Storm accidentally slammed the cage door in Roode's face to pick up the pinfall victory. After the match, the crowd in Philadelphia cheers loudly. Storm realizes what happened and he is furious at ringside. Today and West mentioned that Team 3D are now 22 time tag team champions as Team 3D celebrates in the ring. Backstage, Jeremy Borash is with Kurt Angle and the rest of the main event mafia. He asked about what Jeff Jarrett and Scott Steiner have been discussing lately. Engel said anything they have been talking about has nothing to do with tonight. He then builds his teammates up, Scott Steiner, Kevin Ash, and Booker T tonight. Engel said people call them over the hill, but the young punks are inexperienced and said they know nothing. That Kurt Engel said that he knows something that the young guys don't. You win with your head and not your heart. Lethal Lockdown Match Team Jarrett, Jeff Jarrett, Samoa Joe, AJ Styles, and Christopher Daniels versus Team Angle, Kurt Angle, Booker T, Kevin Nash, and Scott Steiner First two men to start the match are Angle and Daniels Next man to enter is Booker T, then AJ Styles, then Scott Steiner, and then Samoa Joe However, Samoa Joe does not come out immediately His music hits, but he doesn't show Joe is then shown backstage It seems as if he is talking to someone not seen by the camera and then he makes his way out to the ring. Next man to enter is Kevin Nash and finally Jeff Jarrett with all the lethal lockdown participants in the ring the cage roof is lowered and lethal lockdown starts. Team Jarrett defeated Team Angle via pinfall. The finish saw Jarrett grab a guitar from the cage roof and stare down both Booker T and AJ Styles. He teased he was going to hit AJ with the guitar but hit Booker with it instead. Styles then made the cover on Booker to score the victory for Team Jarrett. After the match, Team Jarrett celebrates in the ring when the lights go out. Some new music and a new video plays. And out walks Bobby Lashley. Jarrett appears concerned. Kurt Angle sees us and starts smiling and laughing. Bobby Lashley points down to the ring from the top of the ramp. Backstage, Sting and Mick Foley both cut promos about their TNA World title match tonight. And up next, the main event of TNA Lockdown 2009, the TNA World Heavyweight Championship match. Mick Foley defeated Sting by escaping the cage to become the new TNA World Heavyweight Champion. Finished saw Foley drive his barbed wire bat into the head of Sting. Foley then began to climb the cage. Sting made it back to his feet just as Foley was climbing over the top of the cage to the other side. Sting then climbed up the cage and made it over the top to the other side as well. However, Foley was able to drop down to the floor first to become the new TNA World Heavyweight Champion. After the match, a beat-up Mick Foley is on the ground as TNA referee dropped the World Heavyweight Championship over his body. Foley stands up and kisses the title belt, and his hand is raised high as we see a shot of Sting heading up the ramp in frustration as the pay-per-view goes off the air. Those were your TNA Lockdown 2009 pay-per-view results. I'm Madman Mars 2000.